Last time at Panzer February. We untracked the tank. We pulled the gun and turret. We lifted the deck and we removed all the mechanicals. We lifted out the engine. We started cleaning the tub. We put the Panzer up on timbers, pulled the center six swing arm stations. One of the big challenges we got on retrofitting all of these mounts is the big welds that are on a lot of these pieces right here. So this guy's welded on. This flange right here is welded. You can see these big welds. So what I'm gonna attempt to do without hopefully screwing up the tub is um, go ahead with a plasma cutter, go in and melt those welds out so that we can get it down close enough. Maybe we'll touch it with a grinder, take a chisel and pop these things off without destroying anything. So uh, this is how to remove a weld 101. <laughs> Okay, in 2003, probably about April 2003, this was the first one of these that I welded on. So it's gonna be the first one that comes off. It's like a time machine going backwards here. Ta-da! The can resist. We have to notch the Antos wheels to allow the correct bolt patterns and lug bolts to pass through. We're going to need longer lug bolts, so the old ones have to go. Hey, what's up? It's Ben with Panzer Fabrique. Girls, I'm single. If you want a piece of this, just uh, get on the little Facebook and message, you know, we can, we can do something. We are having fun. I don't know if you can see, it's awful dark here. We're masking <laughs> off the instrument panel so that we don't destroy it in the process of gutting out the inside. Even the idler wheels need to have their mounts modified to match up. All the old pieces need to be dressed for reuse. So this is where we ended up after a five day burst. All of the, uh, the three center pieces are out. The welded on parts are removed. The new one, one will go here, one will go here. One will go here, one will go here. And that'll be our six, that'll be our six pieces.